is revolutionizing wireless communications. By applying advanced machine learning techniques, we can solve difficult technology challenges to enable new and enhanced user experience. This video showcases a collaboration between Qualcomm Technologies and Rode and Schwartz, demonstrating multi-vendor interoperability and performance verification of AI-enhanced channel state feedback AI interface design. Channel state feedback, or CSF, is essential for the effective operation of massive MIMO systems, such as the ones used in today's wide area 5G networks. It enables precise beamforming for high performance data transmissions. The efficacy of the CSF procedure can be enhanced by implementing AI on both ends of the communication channel, in the network and the device. This is what we call cross node AI, which requires separate AI models to run on multiple entities. And they have to work together to realize the maximum benefits. These entities can also be from different vendors as well, which makes it more challenging to optimize and test. Today, the wireless ecosystem is getting ready to overcome this challenge by defining standardized tests, protocols, and procedures to ensure the interoperability. In this trial, Qualcomm and Rod Schwartz are working together to prototype the feasibility of cross-node AI testing and validation, which is essential for real-world wireless AI readiness. And this had to be proven before the commercialization of this cutting-edge technology can take place. The setup of our joint trial includes the AI-ready CMX500 5G one-box signaling tester from Rode and Schwartz, a 3GPP-compliant network emulator that supports ML-based CSI IS feedback enhancement and mobile test devices powered by the Qualcomm 5G modem IF system. Here is how we prepare the test equipment and devices to carry out the validation of our device AI model design. The CMX 5G one-box signaling tester emulates the network side of this AI-enhanced CSF setup. Rode and Schwartz trains the decoder for the one-box signaling tester based on specified reference encoder-decoder models and test conditions. Separately, the device vendor trains a proprietary device encoder based on specified reference encoder-decoder models and the test conditions. The decoder at the CMX500 5G one-box tester signaling tester and the proprietary device encoder are interoperable because both have been trained to be compatible with specified reference models. With the training completed, it's time for some performance testing. As seen in our test, the AI-enhanced CSF can achieve significantly better throughput compared to traditional design that does not support wireless AI. In conclusion, the AI-enhanced CSF we have demonstrated today is not only delivering meaningful gains, but it can also be robustly maintained and tested. The wireless ecosystem is embracing this revolution and developing the necessary frameworks to ensure a smooth transition and seamless interoperability. Stay tuned to learn more as we continue on the wireless AI journey.